Sure. Uh, so shared spectrum is a new uh, capability being added to this uh, cap to, uh, oh, let me start over. Uh, uh, all right. The CBRS Alliance has been working towards creating uh, a new opportunity for us to deploy spectrum. In the past, we had licensed spectrum and we had unlicensed spectrum. And now with CBRS Alliance and some new work being done by the industry along with the government, we now have the ability to use shared spectrum. What Shared Spectrum does is it gives us the opportunity to have the innovation of unlicensed with the security and quality of service that you are used to finding with licensed Spectrum. One of the key use cases for this Shared Spectrum is being able to set up a point of sale device in a secure manner. Uh, the point of sale devices today are typically set up on your Wi-Fi networks, which are also running a lot of your other operation or commercial services. By being able to have a private LT network on a uh, shared spectrum through the CBRS uh, capabilities, you're able to uh, create that better experience and more secure experience with quality for your point of sale devices so that you won't run into problems with uh, somebody being able to hack in and cause issues when you're doing those very important financial transactions. Uh, one of the key aspects of Shared Spectrum and the capabilities associated with it is this opportunity to create priority access. The way the FCC and the industry has set this up is that there will be three levels of, of access given uh, and controlled through a, a database basically um, a spectrum access system called SAS that allows you to be able to make sure that incumbents who are using the spectrum have priority and then people who buy licenses and that's available for 70 megahertz currently uh, of the spectrum. You can purchase a license just like you do with licensed uh, spectrum today and then you'll have priority in that area that you purchase that license and or the unlicensed component, the general availability access that you can get just that works very similar to the way Wi-Fi works today which anybody can deploy in. The idea is that this spurs innovation as well as provides for all the different use cases that might be whether they're very uh, tight use cases that you are used to deploying with licensed or more innovative uh, approaches that you're used to deploying with unlicensed like Wi-Fi.